One of the questions I get asked quite a bit is what throttle body size do I run on my engine? This comes down to what's, whether the engine's force fed or not, normally aspirated, and the size of the engine. People love these because they're, they're 90 mil throttle bodies, right? They will flow a lot of air. But if you're putting this on a 1300 cc engine, right? Anything more than about that is useless because you open that up, it's not going to give you any more power. You've already got what the engine's capacity will be at about a quarter open. So if anything, it's going to send you backwards because on a sharp acceleration like that, you get a big rush of air very quick and you have to accommodate that with fuel and ignition timing. You put that on a big V8, big cubic inch V8, and that might be perfect for it. So assessing the size of throttle body to the engine size is a very important aspect. Um, you will make power out of that, but you may also make it undrivable too, because just remember, as I said, on a 1300cc engine, from there to there is equivalent to wide open throttle on a standard throttle. So that's the equivalent of about that on your throttle pedal. So if you're moving your pedal like that and you're going from idle, full throttle, idle, full throttle, it's going to make it almost undrivable.